Welcome to West 10 Media Signing Day coverage. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Now check out the next athlete, student athlete, that's going to secure their future. Hi, it's Thomas Sellers Jr. here with another signing day. Ms. Carson, uh, congratulations, Dyersburg State Soccer. Thank you. <laughs> now, we're in Tipton County, right? Yes, sir. Most people in Tipton County, most girls like softball, and they go to play softball when they're four years old. How did you get involved in soccer at such a tender age? It was just something I always loved to do. I just like to kick the ball, and I couldn't catch. Okay, another thing that you must love doing, because I ran to Coach Oswald, the cross-country coach up here. You must like running. Yes, sir. Why? It just helps me clear my head when I run. Okay, so when you incorporate your love of running, then with soccer, your love of kicking, it's the dream sport for you, right? Yes, sir. So how does it feel to achieve your dream of going to the next level? It really, like, I'm excited about it because the coach that I'm about to play for, I used to play for on my first club team. Coach Robert. Yeah. And he's, he's, he's trying to develop the game of soccer around here from Covington all the way down to Mumford. He's trying to get girls' love of soccer booming out here in Tipton County. And players like you are doing that. Talk about your, your path, because it's not only been here in Tipton County. What are some of the places you've been? Um, I've played in Covington, but we traveled to Jackson. Okay. I played in Arlington, and I've played for Bartlett. Wow. So you seem some of the best competition in West Tennessee. Yes, sir. So you're ready for this next challenge? Yes, sir. Okay, now talking to your high school coaches, they said they could put you anywhere out there on the field. Is there any favorite place? Do you like defense better, midfield, or I do like you like offensive swimming? better. Okay, why is that? It just gives me a chance to be able to run faster. I don't like staying in one spot. Defense, you stay more on one side of the field, and offense, you get to move around. You don't stay in the same position. Okay, so your coach Lutcher is paying attention to this and kind of hearing what you're saying right now? <laughs> <laughs> I just, I, but at the next level, if you put you out there anywhere, you'd be happy to be out there? Yes, sir. Okay, so all that club ball that you played over West Tennessee, um, somebody that helped you get there. Who are some of the people that helped you reach this dream today? My parents and my family, they have fought for me and continued to put in the money and the amount of work hours to be able to get me to that next level of playing competitive. Okay, so we know about the money and the time. Well, let's, I want to talk about mom and dad for one quick second. What was the biggest contribution mom gave you off the field that we don't get to see? That, that's like, you know, that thing between y'all that helped you get here today? She's just always there for me. And off the field, they would just tell me how I'm doing and like help me play better. I'm not the best at criticism. Okay. I can be, but I'm not really. Okay, nobody likes and, to be <laughs> But, and she would tell me what to do to help me get better. And dad, he would tell me the same things. Yeah. And we'd practice out in the yard. And like going around trees, like acting like players and stuff. Just like my brother Ty. Okay. We practiced in the yard a lot more. Really. Okay, and I did ask him about you being a role model for your little brother Ty. Um, is, is he one of your critics too? Yes, sir, he is. <laughs> That's what little brothers do. Yeah, I got a big sister, so. That's what little brother's supposed to do. But I know you also are conscious that the fact that he's watching everything that you're doing. What do you hope he learns from your journey? What will you tell him when this day comes from him? I would just let him know that he has it. I've seen him play his whole life. He's in the ODP program, which is the Olymp getting into the Olympic trials. If you want to go to the Olympics, you have to be in the ODP. Okay. So he's already there, but I believe he's as good as if better than I am at the moment where he's at right now. And he's just in middle school. Wow. So, hey, that's now that's great for a big sister to say and keep him care. But, hey, you keep knocking down barriers for him and make that little path a little easier for him. So, but you reached your dream and we're here to congratulate you from the middle to the start on making that next step. Thank you.